Hey guys, I just filmed my FabFitFun Fall 2020 unboxing. So now I have the add-ons. I did not receive everything, which I knew right away. If you guys watched that video when I saw the box and I explained the items I got, I was like, there's no way it's all going to fit in here. So I am kind of bummed because the stuff I really wanted is the stuff that I haven't received yet. I did order some makeup, not makeup, well, I got like one setting spray, but I did order some like skincare stuff, some acne stuff, um, stuff like that. And that's mostly what's in this box. But what I, the majority of what I spent my money on was definitely like home stuff. And I only received one of those items so far. And it is by XO Sienna. You guys are going to see it right now. And it's the three vec decorative desk vases and it has like a starry night theme like you guys can see even on the box which is super cute so i also ordered from exo sienna a oh, so cute and it has the same starry uh set it's a teapot with matching mugs that item i haven't received yet and then two other home decor things i got well not really home decor because they have a function is a cute little ceramic tapas set i thought that'd be so cute when i have like little gatherings or even just to put like different dips and stuff like that for just me and my boyfriend during movie nights and then an olive oil and vinegar dispenser like all the stuff I, like i said the home stuff the stuff i really wanted because i have so much makeup and skincare but i did treat myself to some stuff as you're gonna see but the stuff that i really really wanted i didn't get yet i already contacted customer care just so i can get like tracking information on that but this is the set of the three vases. They were only $19. Let me confirm with my little sheet here. Exo Sienna. Oh, $17. Even better. So it comes with a dark blue one, which I will probably keep in the bedroom because it has like a blue theme. It comes with a pink one, which I will probably put in my living room because I do have like a pink living room and a white one which i don't know can go the kitchen the dining room any room really this room so i thought that was really cute i could not pass that up and honestly it matches the vases as well so the vases um the teacup as well so i might incorporate it into my kitchen or living room and kind of have it like all together that would be really cute because they all do match so let's see what else i got there is a lot of stuff in here so Honestly, if you guys saw, I was really confused when I opened my Fabulous Fun box because I do not remember ordering this whatsoever. But it is on the paper invoice they include. But when I looked at my email, it wasn't in there. So, free gift because I wasn't charged it as far as I know. Because I have so many reed diffusers, I'm like, I don't need another reed diffuser. Although this one is very pretty. But I do like having reed diffusers in my bathroom. The one I have is kind of running low, so I guess I can replace it with this one. But this is right here. I'm just going to leave it as is. When that one in the uh, bathroom empties, I will put this one in. But it is the white chi and ginger oil diffuser. Um, I love the like wooden top. It matches with the reed sticks in the back. Can I smell it already? No, obviously, because there's a seal silly me but i don't have a price on this because like i said even though it's included in their invoice it was not so what i usually do is i take their invoice uh i open up my invoice that i received in an email the night i ordered and then i write in pen as you guys can see like all the prices so i can tell you guys what i paid and then the items i have written on the bottom the items that are not in my box just so i can keep track and i did email them already so this was um i don't know if it was supposed to be a free gift or that just happened magically i don't know to be honest with you. and i'm gonna be honest there's another thing in here there's two things in here that i did that are not on my email invoice that i do not remember purchasing so it's kind of crazy this is the other one the other item i do not remember purchasing um and i believe this was an option in the fab fit fun summer box the tell me if i'm wrong no i'm no i'm right but <laughs> Because I remember, yes, I definitely remember this because I thought it was, I remember because I made a fool of myself. I thought it was, um, when you think like beach mist, I automatically think of a texturizing spray for the hair uh, that has like sea salt in it. So you get like those beachy waves. And then after I filmed my customization video, when I filmed the actual opening of me opening the, the summer 2020 box, I realized it was a body spray. It's like an after sun spray. 
Um, so it's four ounces and I cannot tell you how much because I did not purchase it. This is kind of crazy. Like, I don't know. I didn't receive one, two, three, four, five, six products, but I got three or four free products. And uh, I better still be receiving my products or the refund. I will gladly send these back to them because that's not what I, you know, what I wanted. I mean, if, I don't mind it as a little extra, but um, if it's in place of the stuff I really wanted, you know, I'm not going to be too happy. Um, I did buy a Murad product. I remember that right away because one of my favorite YouTubers, Everything Proof Beauty, she said she literally buys it all the time for the full price. So when she saw FabFitFun had it in their sale for like less than half the price, she was going to get it. But it was not this one. The one that I know I purchased was the Skin Perfecting Lotion, which since I'm talking about it, I will just show you guys, which is this right here. She spoke very highly of it, and it was only $19. And I think she said the regular price on it is $49. And it's basically a moisturizer. So I was, I love moisturizers. It's one of the things I do like splurge on. I've always wanted to try something Murad. I've never had anything Murad, and now I have... I got a mirrored sunscreen in my Ipsy, and now I have two. Now, like I said, this one I did choose, I did pay for, was $19. I have that on my invoice. This one I did not. So I I don't have a price for you guys because I did not pick this. When I saw two mirrored products on my invoice, the paper invoice, not my email invoice, I was so confused. I'm like, I only purchased one. And this one is a rapid collagen infusion which I'm going to guess is for, yeah, lines and wrinkles. I never buy anti-aging products because even though I just turned 29, I don't feel like that's a major concern of mine. I mean, I guess I can't hurt to get started. I'm sure I got a little line, you know what I mean? But I'm more worried about the acne. Like, I have tons, as you guys can see. If you guys seen when I first started filming, it was even worse. Quarantine was really tough, and I, the stress acne has been out of control. Um, So I never buy anything acne, like so random um has this ever happened to any of you guys like i'm going to be looking at some of my favorite youtubers everything proof beauty katherine mccarty because i know they always participate in the add-on sales and i'm about to comment on their videos and be like hey did you guys get extra product because i'm just like so confused i'm missing six of things i wanted and i bought i got so far three free items was is that it just three no there's a fourth one i'll show you guys that so that was another free item that i can't tell you how much um the other free item i'm actually really happy with because i love love this product um i treated myself to two sponge gel i love sponge gel um it's basically a like body wash infused buffer so you exfoliate your skin it already has the soap inside it's perfect when the soap runs out you know it's old you toss it away and i always stock up on these i haven't used like a regular loofah in a long time that's literally what it says it says Bye sorry about that i received a phone call so these smell amazing i have never seen a sponge gel scent that i do not enjoy and you know it literally says plus 14 washes 14 plus washes so um even the sale price on these was seven dollars each and i remember treating myself to two of them which were these two the vanilla zest and the eucalyptus rain because the descriptions on the smell sounded really good this one i did not get it is not on my emailed invoice from that night it is only on their paper invoice so i'm gonna guess it was seven dollars just like these but i was not charged this i don't know i am like at a loss for words honestly so i got four products i did not get i mean i will use this i am happy with it i will use the products i just like i'm lost i'm really truly lost uh, but anyway this is the sugar delilah I, I i don't know what else to say i really really don't i'm like so confused and usually when an item is not in your box so it's happened before i've had uh my fall box i had ordered a kate somerville um something acid helps get rid of acne a salic sal a salic acid whatever um and it was i'm just folding it because my address is at the top but it was listed 
and where it says one, instead of saying one, it would say zero. And that's how you know it's shipping separately. None of these items that I ordered are on the invoice saying zero and I explained that in the email I said you know I know sometimes you got ship items separately but usually it's on my invoice and it has zero for the quantity and it, these products do not say that so I said am I receiving these items can I get tracking information so I will definitely do a like follow-up video and let you guys know so and then there was so there was actually one more product that I got for free so I got five for free um and that was same thing I knew I bought a Grown Alchemist product. It was their facial cleanser. But I saw two Grown Alchemist products in my invoice. So I was really confused because I only ordered one. And so this is the gel facial gel cleanser. I did purchase this one. So it was uh, $14 through FabFitFun. And why do I feel like I have this? I think I do have a grown alchemist cleanser, but it's different because this one's gel and I'm pretty sure mine came in glass. Anyway, that doesn't matter. I, I purchased this. I wanted it. I got it. Even if I regret my choice now. It was like I said, it was $14. But I have another grown alchemist product in my box that I did not ask for. And it is the Hydra Repair Day Cream. So it's a moisturizer. I do like moisturizers. I don't. It like makes me not even want to do the sales anymore because I'm just like at a loss for words. Like I don't want to screw people over either. So it's not like I want the free products, but then it's also like I'm not receiving products. So I got one Murad, the Beach Mist, the Diffuser, and a sponge at one, two, three, four. I got five products for free, but didn't receive six of my products. And I'm pretty sure these would definitely be cheaper than my products. Because because my products were home decor, almost everything I get on the FabFitFun Ed sale for um skincare is under 20 um but all those home decor items were 20 and over 22 24 26 so like what i'm missing adds up and uh, i'm just i'm at a loss but anyway this is the grown alchemist hydro repair day cream i do like moisturizers i'm surprised i didn't get that but i know for a fact i didn't because like i said it is not in my emailed invoice from what i purchased that night I know sometimes they do throw in a free gift. Um, it's happened in the last box. If you use the FabFit, if you purchased items through your FabFitFun app and spent X amount of money, maybe it was a hundred dollars, something like that. Um, I don't remember doing anything about a free gift. And even if there was, I could see one gift and maybe every hundred. So maybe I could be eligible for three gifts. But this is how many? I already forgot how many free products I got. One, two, three, four, five like all right so now i'm just gonna get into the stuff i know i purchased so i grabbed this instant smooth dry shave gel i paid five dollars for it one of my youtubers that i really enjoy oh i don't know her name i just started following her she's smaller base i think she only has like 2k and she says that this lasts her a while because what she does is she holds on to it for like you know how sometimes you get out of the shower and you realize you missed the spot so instead of having to like get back in the shower and turn on the water you can do a quick little dry shave with this because it is like a obviously it's a dry shave gel they call it on the slip it's literally called a showerless shave gel uh by busy beauty it says no water needed so i know that's happened to me countless times over and over again so i figured this is definitely a good product to have or even if you want to take it like just on vacation or you can even leave this like in your bag because you never know uh in your like purse or whatever if you're someone who will carry a bigger purse because then you're like oh shit i missed the spot so i mean it was only five dollars and she seemed to really enjoy it so i figured i would get it and then i ordered um the dermalect rapid repair facial moisturizer you like like i just said i'm into moisturizers and it was only 11 dollars. like i said a lot of the skincare i get i think that murad for 19 was the most expensive thing almost everything else i get is honestly below 15 bucks it was definitely the home stuff that uh took up more of my uh money but this is it right here and it says it's calming soothing hydrating de-stressing um apply to clean skin a.m or p.m so i figured i would give that a shot i definitely you guys tell i'm disappointed i don't know i'm just 
it's not really disappointed like i'm sure i'll get my money and my products but i'm just confused and i don't like feeling this way like i don't feel like i'm screwing people like i don't like the idea of like i'm screwing someone over and it's like the products i was so excited for didn't come and i'm so mad because when i first got the fab fit fun box i was so excited you guys can see like look at that video of me opening the fall 2020 because i did decide to do this as two separate videos because that one was already hitting 45 minutes but that it's literally i mean it's literally i just filmed it it's like in real time i literally am in this outfit and i literally the doorbell just rang and i literally ran down and so excited and i showed my scissors and me cutting open the box and i'm just like at a at a loss for words right now i i truly am all right, so the next thing I got was this. I don't even know how to pronounce that, but it is a enzyme cleansing powder. It comes with 30 individual sticks. I thought this would be perfect for travel. Uh, it's only $9, and I know it had really good reviews. I always watch Everything Proof Beauty. She does like a whole, she reviews like all the beauty products. Um, hair, makeup, bath and body, skincare and uh i i kind of go by like what i should get by her videos but basically these are perfect you literally just open this add water and cleanse your face with it so like i said these are perfect for travel so that is what i will hold on to these for instead of packing like my big tube i will have these so i thought that was good i mean for nine dollars i feel like you cannot beat that i keep covering my ring light so i'm getting like darker and darker as i show you guys the products oh let me stop doing that so what else is on my list okay this right here again another brand i do not know how to pronounce but it is a leave-in treatment and detangler it was five dollars through fab fit fun and it is an oregon or or whatever you know what i'm trying to say and hemp oil therapy and it's a leave-in treatment and detangler i can always use that my hair has been cray cray i've even been telling you guys i'm debating on just chopping it off and i just haven't had the nerve to do it yet and it just says spray evenly on clean towel dried hair comb through and style as desired our restorative blend of argon that's it argon i can't i knew that sounded wrong of argon and hemp seed oil instantly moisturizes and detangles hair while also smoothing unwanted frizz and flyaways good for all hair types safe for safe for color treated hair <sighs> the next thing on the list was the poopery but this is different this is not for you to spray in your toilet i do love the original poopery but poopery has really expanded their brand i've been getting emails about them doing um hand sanitizer hand sanitizer wipes definitely a good time for it with everything going on i appreciate that they wrapped it in plastic it's, if it did leak it wasn't going to get all over my box but this is actually the shoe odor eliminator uh it says kick shoe odor to the curb poopery shoe odor eliminating spray is an odor stomping blend of natural essential oils and enzymes that eliminate shoe odor at the molecular level and it says spritz one to two sprays into fabric sole shoes um stink free guaranteed and it says up to 200 uses it is four ounces this definitely works uh the toilet version i always have one in my bathroom i've even sometimes carried it in my purse um so i'm definitely curious to try it in my shoes um the shoes i wear uh like you know just to go on a quick shopping trip quick errand they don't get sweaty but the ones i wear for work because i am wearing it for seven to eight hours a day the ones uh for when i work out you know the sneakers they definitely have a smell um i wouldn't say like i i barely smell my armpits like this is just me being real with you guys i generally don't have like a whole armpit issue like my boyfriend can only wear like clinical deodorant um i've only noticed an issue now that i'm trying to go more natural with my deodorants but before that i never noticed a difference so i am trying to find a good natural deodorant i actually got one through my cause box add-ons that they call theirs marketplace or something like that and it was native and so far since i switched to that one i haven't noticed a difference and i just found out they actually carry native at target which is nice oh, and they also do a subscription service where you can get it delivered to your house so if any of you guys have considered natural deodorant that's definitely a good brand to check on there's so many different smells um but my feet is definitely the sweatest area of my body definitely where it's smelly i remember i went on the europe trip in high school uh it was spring break and we did paris roman paris rome and um london and there was tons of walking obviously and the second i took off my shoes at the hotel room 
instant smell my roommate was like ugh, and i'm like i'm sorry it's like the only place where i sweat but it's only the shoes like i said that i wear for long periods of time or work out in um so i'm definitely happy to have these i had an ex-boyfriend who would be like so grossed out by the <laughs> by the smell of my shoes when i went to his like when if i went to his house like right after work um let's see what is next on my list this list shows it in abc order but obviously i jumped around because i showed you guys the products i got for free all right so the next thing is the scandinavia this is the only like makeup thing i got because i have tons of makeup you guys know i get ipsy i get ice cream beauty uh so i was like i do not need any more makeup oh, and i even got makeup in an add-on sale it was beauty bakery i was always dying to try their products and it was like half the price so i had to get it but this is the one thing i allowed myself to get because i have heard amazing things about this setting spray so again i appreciate it's in plastic so if it leaks it doesn't make a mess and it is a fine mist oil free paraben free um bottle i mean sorry guys setting spray i'm just like i don't i'm just confused and at a loss for words honestly but anyway it helps to prevent makeup from creasing or melting while minimizing the need for touch-ups absorbs quickly and lasts for up to 16 hours and people said that it really did make their ma makeup last hours longer than usual and i believe the regular price on this is over 20 dollars 22 or something like that and through fab fit fun i actually got it for 12 so i was really excited to get that the next thing on my invoice is the sponge gels which i showed you um then i received two things by this brand um i had heard really good things about the skin toner and then i figured i would try the sleeping mask as well i feel like when i hear good things about a brand like one specific product then it makes me want to try other products because i feel like they all kind of have the same formula but that might not always be true like they can be good at one thing and not be good at another but these were honestly really cheap um the toner was only five dollars and it's made out of like organic rice water or something like that yeah this is definitely based out of okay it says made in korea because if you guys can see it's all like chinese symbols in the back can you guys see that it is a clear background so it's, it's having a hard time picking up but right there that is all chinese symbols um, but it says energizing while gentle at the same time it helps to rebalance the ph level of the skin efficient for exfoliation to eliminate de dead skin cells and deep clean the pores i love using a cleanser a, a cleanser i love using a toner after i cleanse my face and it's probably one of the my favorite things about my skincare routine my skin always feels so clean and refreshed after a toner. Sometimes it's even a little tingly. And then I just slap on a good moisturizer and go to bed. I love it. So this one is cruelty-free, fragrance-free, paraben-free, and mineral oil-free. So I said $5. It's free of all those things. And I had good reviews. Why not? And then the sleeping mask was only 7 So I figured I would give that a shot as well. Um, it says protects various skin conditions from harsh environments. For a brighter and softer skin with the help of major antioxidant compounds called lysopene from tomatoes. Ooh, interesting. The silky finish of the mask enhances the speed of absorption and advances rejuvenation during sleep. Uh, sleep. So, I'm a little more excited now. I'm like, I just why like, even though I, I, you know, I have a lot of skincare and I definitely don't want to do an overload of skincare, but uh, it's really curious. That's one thing about FabFitFun. Like, this is a brand I've never heard of. Um... I mean, it's based out of Korea, but I heard really good things about. So it's like I never would have got it, but because it was available through FabFitFun, especially at such a good price, it was only $7, I decided to get it. And it says whether or not you use this as a regular daytime moisturizer or sleeping mask, use, that ev use at the very last step of your skincare routine. And I'm just curious to see. Okay, it does have a safety seal. I don't know why I always think it's not going to have a safety seal. I just want uh, let's see i'm just curious to see like the color and the texture of it i know the toner was gonna get too messy if i try because obviously that's like liquid all right so it is just like a white you know what let's just put it on my face even though i ain't even cleanse yet but oh it smelled really good and it feels really good so it does get this one is like multifunctional which i like you can use it as like a normal um daytime moisturizer or it says you can put it on at night to kind of be like a sleeping mask so definitely excited to try that okay okay and then i grabbed 
two things for my acne because I'm getting really sick of it. <laughs> um, and this was such a good price. It is 72 acne patches. I have never tried acne patches, but I've heard really good things about them. Um, it is acne fighting super dots. So you literally just put the dot on and go to bed and then you wake up and it's supposed to have dried out your pimple. I mean, they're not going to disappear overnight, but they're supposed to heal a lot quicker. So it says new invisible and easy peel design. So if these are truly invisible, you can wear them during the day as well. I've seen some that really do like kind of match the skin color or they're kind of clear. And I've seen some that are like very obvious. You only wear them at night. It says natural and gentle protection formula, latex free, gluten free and vegan. And then there's two size patches in the bag. So there's like a bigger one and a smaller one. If you guys can see that. So that's perfect depending on the size of your pimple. So let's see. It says apply the patch on acne and press down firmly. Leave it on the affected area for at least six hours and take off the patch and enjoy clear skin. I don't know if this is something I would wear out to be honest with you guys. But I could definitely see myself wearing this at night um and it says it was manufactured in may 18 of 2020 and it says it's good till may 17 2023 so it's definitely lasts me a good amount of time made in china but it is based out of Bo boca raton florida and it says it helps reduce the redness of blemishes hydroclotic helps the affected area remain moist while promotes healing protects against dirt and external contact it says maybe use prior to makeup application to help keep the acne from being infected by cosmetics so you can it's saying you can wear makeup over this interesting breathable and waterproof and it absorbs secretions and it says directions clean your face chest or back so that's really nice i never even thought of that because i never really have acne anywhere but my face but if I do get, sometimes one will pop up on my boobs or whatever. And my boyfriend definitely has some acne on his back. So this one you can use on your face, chest, or back. It says clean and thoroughly dry hands and pimple area. Place one acne fighting super dot over pimple and gently press edges to seal. Leave on for six to eight hours to remove, wash and dry your hands. Grasp the edge of the super dot and stretch until it releases from the skin. Clean affected area with the truly clear soap bar which i actually did buy that's the next thing and store unused super dots in a sealed bag and i believe this is a sealed bag so i'm gonna rip it open i'm not gonna put it on now because you know my face isn't cleansed and my hands aren't clean i'm just curious to see what it looks like yeah so this is a sealed bag so i can kind of just keep it back in here but this is it right here so it came with two and as you can see, it's all different sizes. So I would just peel off the foil in the back. And they do look like to be a very light, clearish patch. So um, I have been debating on doing like review videos. So if that's something that interests you guys, let me know. Or I can even do like a review tab on my Instagram highlights and do it that way. If I don't want to do like a whole video. And then I got the Truly Clear Confidence case oh my god i thought it came with the soap i and i had the bar of soap in my car and i didn't get it because i thought this one came with both yeah this is just the case if i had known i would have got the soap hopefully the soap will be in the edit sale or another add-on sale not that i even feel like doing this anymore like i'm so annoyed Unless I just buy it directly from the website. But it's a bar of soap. that, And it, I got them off my boyfriend because I really only have like face acne. So I use like just cleansers. But he has back acne. So I had bought, it was a bar of soap. I swear this was supposed to come with the soap. I'm about to, I am so disappointed. Like you guys have no idea. But you are supposed to keep the bar of soap in here in between washes. And it even has like the little draining thing in there so the soap doesn't sit. Um, I honestly, if you guys watch, I have, I'll make use of this so it's fine. But this cost me $10. It even says bundle only. So how is this a bundle if it only comes with one thing? But I have a, um, and I even told my boyfriend I ordered this for him. I have a, and the bar was $7, like the soap bar. And I was like, oh, $10 and I get the bar and the case, might as well. 
but it was only um Yeah, it was $10. Anyway, I had, did a video of a handmade soap company I ordered from. It was a local business. Uh, I, I need to start shopping more and more local and screw the big companies. Um, and it was a... Um, so, I, she gave me a soap saver. But, I mean, I guess I can have an extra soap saver. I like that that one has a cover so I can close it, to be honest with you guys. So, I will make use of it with the handmade soaps I've been purchasing. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay? It's fine. And then last but not least, not kind of the products I was supposed to receive, is the Winky Lux Birthday Party Highlighter. And it was $7. Oh, so I did buy one of the makeup thing. That's right. Um, like you guys know, I know I love highlighter. Um, and usually you can, you can see all the products in front of me that I've been showing you guys. Anyway, usually when I um, get highlighter, I usually go more like gold, champagne-y. So this one was pink. I thought I would give it a shot. It was really interesting. Um, had good reviews. Seven bucks. And that's basically it. Um, I was supposed to receive two other skincare type things. It was another toner. Because you guys know I like toner. And it was uh, pads. Because I do like to use the pads on my face. Um, and then it was all the home decorating things that i mentioned like the kitchen items and then my fall fab fit fun box you guys saw um i had done like a, an additional choice you pay a few extra dollars and you can get two things from the same category i had gotten the uncommon james set of two copper canisters i paid an extra 15 that was one of the things i was most excited for and i also did not get that so i'm honestly really confused um has this ever happened to any of you guys comment below i'm definitely curious uh i already contacted fab fit fun I didn't even realize how many items I was really missing, though. I only mentioned the home things um, and the canisters. But as I was going through and writing down the prices for you guys, I realized I was missing two other skincare items. So depending on what they say in the email, I will definitely be telling them, hey, there's two other things. I don't know what's going on. I will even be open and honest. Say there was things in my box I did not purchase. Not going to lie, though. I have not been to the post office since this happened. I was considering doing a giveaway soon. But I don't know why the thought of the post office really scares me. I mean, any public place at this point really scares me. I only go if it's extremely necessary, like the grocery store. So um, I find my anxiety getting worse and worse as time is going by. So it's like, uh, if I have to go to the post office to send them that back, that's really going to be inconvenient. But that's it for this video, guys. Um, Just like the video. It really helps the YouTube algorithm if you want to help me out comment below that helps me out as well like i said did you guys has this got ever happened to you guys i'm really curious and i will have other unboxings and other hauls uh, tons of content coming your way so subscribe if you're interested all right guys be safe